Good afternoon, everyone, and thanks for logging on to your Aggieland Carpet One forecast. It was a sunny start to Friday after some overnight thunderstorms, but the clouds are already back in the picture, and we could even see a couple of showers and thunderstorms a little bit later on today. Here's a look at the satellite and radar across the entire Lone Star State. Most of the shower activity is to our north and to our west this afternoon, and then even again down towards the south, towards the uh, Houston area and towards the coast. Right now, we're pretty quiet across the Brazos Valley, but plenty of clouds are rolling through, and we could see a couple of showers throughout the afternoon. Coverage isn't going to be great where it really looks like we'll start to see better chances of rain is going into the overnight hours once again so a couple of thunderstorms will be possible and what we're really looking at is the potential for some heavy rain and possibly some localized flooding as well we're not expecting any severe weather at this point but this could definitely present some problems with driving going into saturday morning looks like things will start to thin out a little bit and the hope is and the thinking is that by midday things will start to clear out a little bit. There is a chance though that we could still be dealing with some showers in the mid to late afternoon hours on Saturday. Again, not expecting anything severe, but it could make things a little bit damp by the evening hours on Saturday. Bottom line, it's going to be a whole lot cooler, pretty breezy, and more comfortable. And in fact, you might even need a jacket with you for your Saturday evening plans. There's a look at Sunday afternoon, not a cloud in the sky, should be absolutely beautiful. So another look at your Friday, about a 50% shot of showers throughout the entire day with temperatures hovering right around the low 70s. And then going into tonight, a low of about 60 degrees. Rain and thunderstorms, very, very likely. Going into tomorrow, mostly just morning rain, but there is a possibility we could see a couple of showers in the afternoon hours as well. After that, we dry out a little bit with highs only in the 60s.